welcome into Celebrity Chatter and Things That Matter with Elijah. And I'm interviewing uh, Cooper Andrews. Hello. <laughs> I love the name of your show. Thank you. My first question is, how did you feel when you got the role in Shazam? When I got the role in the Shazam film, how did I feel? I felt great. I also felt like, like, am I ready for a movie kind of thing. It was my yeah. first, you know, it was the first time I did something, uh, as far as the film went, like to that to that size, and then I was also like a massive fan of a lot of the people I was working with. So I was like, all right, I gotta go on the show. It's gotta be cool. Act like I've done this before. So I was excited and a little nervous, which is you know just it's fine. Normal, yeah. And then I didn't know what to wear because I knew it was gonna be cold. So the next thing was get a really good winter jacket and really good yeah. winter shoes. Yeah. Got excited, then I thought practically, what should I be wearing? <laughs> yeah, you bet. Yeah, to be uh, prepared. Exactly. Always. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Second question is, do you have any dating advice for us? Any dating advice for us? Well, dating advice is the same. Is the same as I guess just on how to be true to yourself in a sense. Yeah. So I feel like if you're gonna date somebody, date someone who knows who you are actually. You know, so it's it's very important to be honest with yourself, um, and and not you know not try and be something you're not. So yeah. so I think I think anyone is attracted to that. People that are true to themselves, um, and yourself? and and yeah. mints. I really can't if if anyone ever offers you a stick of gum or mint, and you're like, oh, I don't chew gum. You can chew the mint out of it and then spit it out into a trash can. Take the mints. You know, be yourself. Eat yeah. a mint. <laughs> yeah. What are your hobbies? Who my hobbies? Um, number one is I, I like I like filming stuff. So yeah, I, it's what yeah. I did before yeah. I got into the business. I love like some people like drawing. I mean, I love drawing too. That's a yeah, hobby. Yeah, it's fun. Yeah. Um, but I like drawing so that I can then shoot shoot these things. So I like making. I make a lot of little projects uh, for myself and my friends. I don't post. I just you know it's fun little like. Yeah silly shtick stuff and I like playing piano and I like to play my drums uh, so I guess music yeah I like I like uh, slow cooking you ever eat brisket are you uh, a brisket person not really it's but, fair because you haven't had yeah. mine <laughs> most people yeah I make a really good brisket so I like doing that and then uh, I, I think friends I think friends family is like the most important thing so you know yeah, yeah. I like hanging out I like hanging out with friends, and that's why I like this job. You know, it's like right. when you get to make movies. I remember like one of the first things we did. I stuck my uh, my mom and my sister when she was three, and the, they just played like little background characters in the uh, in this film. You yeah. know, it's it's a good excuse to just work with people you right. enjoy working with. Yeah. yeah. My final question is: Do you have any advice for young actors? Any advice for young actors? It's going to be the same as dating. Um, be yourself a lot. So yeah. when you when you're playing a character, I think it's important to figure out how you want to do it and not so much how you want to do it while you're interpreting interpreting the writing. So some people they just want to serve the script. And right. I think that's great. I think that's and I think that's what we're all supposed to do. Right. But how can I serve the script that's uniquely different to from someone else? else. Yeah. yeah. So it's it's what can you do to make it why should you have this role? What can you share with it? Yes. So a lot of people look at like, a lot of people talk about, oh, audition is about rejection. You know, acting is about rejection. I'm like, it's not about rejection. They're not rejecting you. It's like, it's like if you own a restaurant and someone goes to the re restaurant next to you, you know, and they like your restaurant. And it's like, oh, I like this Italian place, but tonight I want Thai food. Right, yeah. It's, it's not an insult. So a lot of people take it personally. When it's really about just finding the right fit, it can. It's kind of like just playing different superheroes and how like how like well I'm Flash and I'm gonna be this different Flash, but I'm gonna critique this part a little. Yeah, and it's make it more different and better. Right, it's, yeah. I don't even know if it's. I think different. I feel like every. I, I feel like a lot of the actors would be very cool with how other people play it. It's yeah. just we want our own interp you know, your own interpretation, and and I think as a. As a viewer, we want that as well. So I guess as as an actor, try not to imitate anybody. You know, be be as much of yourself. Bring yourself out as much as you can yeah. uh, into your roles. 
And then the, and the next thing is like, don't look at it as rejection. It's, you know, mm -hmm. unless they're saying we're rejecting you. Yeah. You know? so, then I guess that's rejection. <laughs> yeah. Ready? Should Should, whoa, whoa, whoa. No. No, no, no. We talked about this outside. Outside. All right. And after you get homework done, you eat your food. All right, your veggies, get it all in. You gotta eat my veggies also. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you for not yeah. putting a hole in the ceiling. That <laughs> yeah. could have sucked. Appreciate yeah. that. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Thank you, yeah. Shazam!